the sea energy vibration um weekly reading for the Aquarian Sun Moon and Rising sign Aquarians okay the monthlies are out this is a week of water you are an air sign so it is the week of the lovers so um, I'm calling the divine angel light beams pure light beams to come in um, the divine universal angels and guiding angels to show us the energy um, for the Aquarians in the first week of September um, first week of September 2019 um, please uh, come in light beams the white light beams divine light divine angel divine spirit guides uh, um, for the Aquarian Sun Moon horizon sign I want to say I'm calling in the angels of love the guiding angels for the Aquarian Sun Moon horizon sign the planet of Pluto to come in and to help and show us what is the message for the Aquarian Sun Moon horizon sign um, the month of September reading is all out for you Aquarians please like share these readings and um, press the notification button um, download your on-demand because there is where extra information over the month is going to be coming up please like and share these videos now let's get in and see what's coming up for the Aquarian so your own energy is in the reverse you Aquarian so be careful what is coming up for you guys because your own energy is in reverse I'm seeing also the energy with family so a new start with family it's not going to be happening that is in reverse I'm seeing you turning your back to a situation and I'm seeing some of you going to look for better shores okay I'm seeing you turning your back to certain situation and you're going to look for better shores so I'm seeing the foundation um, is um, not what you wish I'm seeing you're trying to find a new start so um, that's one of the situation which is also in the reverse I'm seeing the message that you were expecting from family members you're not going to be receiving it because the energy of your enemies are up and it's the end of a situation that you were dealing with some family members okay so what I'm seeing here is that issues with family members is as if um, there is no connection there is no information you're not receiving any message from these family members and that sort of a thing whatever the issue was whatever the situation was is as if um, these family member um, are not connecting and you're saying "Ooh, whatever you saw that it's spring out okay so definitely you're in limbo a lot of you are in limbo this week is a limbo It's the first week of September and it's a healing week it is your week so there is a lot of reverse energies that is coming up and it's as if there is the end of an issue with a family situation and it's as if you're in limbo because you're waiting to make a new start for yourself some of you could have been travel some of you could have relocated and travel and there is nothing the major or kind of you have like a four major arcana two is the in the upright because the center of your week is ends endings and new beginning and you seeing the truth of a situation endings and new beginnings and you're seeing the truth of a situation there so there was endings new beginning and you're seeing the truth of a situation what we're also seeing is that you wanted a new start but this new start is not yet here um, but um, it's not gonna happen in the first week but it will happen in the second week okay um, it is a positive week okay so messages are falling out so with the energy of your enemies I'm seeing the energy of the five of cups some of you have regrets dealing with someone this could be a scorpion or a cancer some of you have regrets dealing with a scorpion or a cancer you are seeing the truth about the situation and you are aware of what has transpired for some of you you are aware of the situation and you're seeing exactly what has transpired so some of you were dealing with a scorpion um, 
whatever this situation is you have regrets dealing with this person and you're seeing the truth about this person this new start with a family member and you need to stand your ground with these people whoever these people are and whatever is transpiring I'm seeing that you need to stand your ground with these people you're not standing up I'm seeing you young um, um, people between the age of 18 and 45 um, you are thinking about turning your back uh, on a family situation or turning your back on someone you have known from past lifetime you're definitely turning your back on this person and looking forward the energy of the devil is here and the energy of the devil is where you're dealing with an Aries for some of you but some of you this is just negative influence from outside that is trying to block you but this is not going to be working out in this week secrets are going to be coming out things are going to be coming out that you weren't aware of so be um, expected because things are going to be coming out that you weren't aware of there is a lot of lies and deception around you it could be coming from you there's art breaks and you were art broken like coming out of the month you were all broken coming in this new month there is no news you were expecting news you were expecting some information there is no news that is coming in okay there is absolutely no news that is coming in so for you guys it's a week to take some rest and really focus on yourself because whatever the issue is and the situation there is no news that is coming in so it's like endings that is here there is some endings that is here and some new beginning there is a lot of all outside influence that is coming in at you so you have to be aware of this okay um what other messages is here to connect these two together i'm seeing some deceitfulness some um deceitful situation that is coming up okay so let's look at this deceitful it's a seven of swords and if you watch my reading all the time you know I'm always looking at what is happening so you got to be aware because there is an issue there is a situation so there is some deceptive something that, that there is the block to the deceptive things in an organization okay an organization overseas or organization um, um, not in the same location where you are uh, they're now blocked because there was some deceptive situation that has happened and they're now blocked okay so whatever you were dealing with some deceptive situation that is not within reach of you they're now blocked and they're no longer can affect you what is happening is that I'm going to see that some of you could be traveling or yeah some of you could be traveling some of you could have traveled um, and um, you are having a this new start you still have to wait for information okay but definitely I'm seeing definitely that some of you are going to be moving um, the move is here it's as if you already move and you know it's a new start in a new house and you're feeling much better than you was if you think that it is and there is a chance to move you should move because there is going to be a better situation that is coming in for you okay all right in this week we have two cards um, these are the two cards we have a right hand or left hand so choose whether the right hand or my left hand right hand or left hand if you choose my right hand you have the angel of Maya and it says school and study education help your life purpose and personal growth at this time the angel will guide you and help you with this process okay so Maya some of you might be wanting to change career and that sort of a thing and Maya is the angels to call, call upon the angels and ask this angels to help you to show you what is the new career part what is the right part what is it that you need to study how is it that you need to um, implement these things and she will come up if you choose the left hand it is my angel she looks like me it is angel Shanti and the angel Shanti is here it's actually an Indian angel and if you look her hair is like my hair. <laughs> I am the angel of peace I bring you new tranquility and a smooth road ahead okay so it's as if you Aquarians start this week with peace tranquility and Shanti comes in to guide you and bring you to that peaceful place and that peaceful road ahead 
whatever the negative energies that you were dealing with because a lot of out for outside forces of negative energy some of you could be working with negative energy and this is returning in your life and this is why I said to people you got to be careful what you do because whatever you give out really do come back because I'm seeing some negative energies where um, at a house or a house situation there is some negative energies I'm definitely seeing some secrets coming out and the secrets could be um, a Pisces or a psychic could be telling you something so that is something and it's good for you Aquarians to go check out the monthly readings and why this is check out the monthly readings and and the moon readings again because there is other information there their information that is going to be helping you and it's going to be supporting you heartbreaks is over there was some heartbreaks um, some of you could have gone on vacation and it didn't go well or some um, issues and situation um, but this is going to be over the energy of the house is here where is as if some of you just move in the month of September or is packing up to move but this is going to be good some of you between the age of 18 and 45 are really having an issues family issues where um, your energy is like kind of in the reverse and some unexpected information about family is going to be coming into you there's definitely lower negative in influence that is coming at you so you got to be careful some of you really have some regrets dealing with a Scorpio or a, or a cancer there the deception that you have been doing sorry or someone has been doing against you this is going to be over and this is going to be ended. I want to say namaste. Until next week, please like, share these videos.